Hello! Welcome to another First Contact Polymer informational video. Today, we will be talking about our S16 AR. These sprayers are very useful for coating large mirrors or coating small mirrors quickly. You could pressurize them with either an air compressor or a bicycle pump. The bicycle pump does take more time, but it's easy to use and accessible if a compressor is not available, for example if cleaning optics in field conditions. Please note, per the manufacturer, that you need to leave at least one-third empty or no more than two-thirds full. We filled our sprayer with 200 milliliters of red spray and found that 60 pumps with the bicycle pump creates approximately 40 psi, while 80 pumps creates approximately 60 psi. The sprayer should never be pressurized over 200 psi. I'm attaching the bike pump to the S16AR and clipping it on and flipping the latch to secure it. It also helps to hold it in place with your hand. This is using a coarse sprayer at about 60 PSI. We find that the higher PSI creates a better spray pattern. For example, 60 PSI has a very smooth pattern and above 60 PSI simply causes more polymer to be dispensed faster. On the contrary, below 40 PSI creates a less consistent spray pattern. The sprayers come with a selection of four nozzles, ranging from fine to coarse. The fine nozzle creates a nice consistency and is great for smaller optics, also for the initial tack coat on vertically mounted optics because it releases less polymer, while the coarse nozzle is suitable for larger optics because it allows more polymer to be dispensed. Remember to keep the sprayer close to the surface you will be cleaning to minimize these spider webs from forming, although they are a harmless byproduct. Thank you so much for watching this video, and have a great rest of your day.